we want to be able to use a part of Excel called Goal Seek, which will allow us to solve simple functions. So let's look at this example, where f of x is equal to 4x plus 6. So I want to know what is the value of x when f of x is equal to 26. So what it is that I want, I want to solve when 26 is equal to 4x plus 6. I want to solve for x. Now I can do this by hand, or I can let Excel do the lifting for me and solve it using Excel. And so that's what I'm going to do. So the first thing I need to do is come to Excel, and I'm going to set this up as x, and I'm going to highlight this cell in light blue to let me know that's my variable. And I'm going to set up f of x, which is equal to 4 times x plus 6. And there's my function now. Okay, and so what we want is Excel to choose a number here in x, such that f of x is equal to 26. And so to do that, I come up to my ribbon, up to data, and choose what if analysis, and go to goal seek. Now if I let my cursor hover there, it'll tell me, find the right input for the value you want. That's what we want to do. We want to find the value of x that makes our function equal to 26. So to do so, first we need to set, uh, choose our set cell, which in this case is going to be our function, because we want our set cell equal to 26. And we want Excel to choose x such that f of x is equal to 26. I click OK, it runs through the algorithm, and it solves it out, so I get x and f of x, and that's the answer. And I can continue to change this function. If now instead of 4x plus 6, I want to find the value when 6x plus 6 is equal to 26, then I come back here to goal seek and simply say, take my function f of x, which is cell b2, set that equal to 26 by changing cell a2, which is my x, click solve, and that answer now is 3.3. So we can use goal seek to solve out simple algebraic functions for us.